Today, guys, on Beer Geek Nation, we are looking at a release from Anderson Valley Brewing out of California. This is their Bourbon Barrel Stout. It's a 6.9% alcohol by volume stout aged in wild turkey barrels for three months. Now, three months, you might think that doesn't sound like a whole lot of time, but being that it is a lower alcohol beer, you don't need to put it in a barrel for that long. It's going to impart flavor pretty quickly because it just doesn't have all that complexity they kind of need to balance out. So, three months sounds perfect for this. It's very, very very affordable, very widely available. I know I'm in Pennsylvania, I can get this. Uh, runs between 10 and 12 bucks a bottle. You can get it at qualityliquorstore.com if you can't get it in your area. So excited about this one. You know, I like sessionable barrel-aged beers and there aren't too many of them. So looking forward to it. Let me get into a glass, let you guys know how it smells, tastes, and give you the final verdict on the Anderson Valley Bourbon Barrel Stout. All right guys, the aroma on the Bourbon Barrel Stout. Wow, coconut, vanilla, oakiness from that barrel. Chocolate, coffee, those typical stout characteristics kind of creeping in. A little bit of a roasty nose to it, a roasty malty backbone in there. A really nice smelling beer, kind of represents what the name is. All right guys, so the taste on the Bourbon Barrel Stout. Cheers. Oh wow, it's really nice, man, yeah. Right at the front of the tongue, you get a little bit of chocolate, a milk chocolate, a kind of a sweet chocolate, a little bit of that vanilla from the bourbon barrel. Middle of the mouth, big roastiness, some of that coffee bitterness kind of starts to come into play. Oakiness, a little bit of a, co a, a toasted coconut flavor, again, from that barrel, playing off the vanilla from the, from the bourbon barrel as well. Pretty sweet aftertaste. In the aftertaste, I'm getting more coffee, more of a dark chocolate bitterness, a little bit of that espresso, uh, a little bit of like a cocoa powder type of flavor, more vanilla. There's kind of an underlying caramel toffee uh, undertone throughout the beer as well, and it really kind of plays off the bourbon barrel and the chocolate and the vanilla really nicely. A very, very drinkable beer. Again, at 6.9%, almost sessionable, um, but it's got a lot of flavor to it for that, for a lower ABV beer. Really, really nice stuff. All right, guys, so the final verdict on the Anderson Valley Bourbon Barrel Stout, 6.9%. You can go to qualityliquorstore.com if you can't get it locally. Guys, going to give this one an A. A really big surprise. You know, it had a lot going for it. It's a Bourbon Barrel Stout. at 6.9%, so it's almost sessionable. Um, I've never had an Anderson Valley beer, but I'm definitely going to be searching out more of their beers after this one. It just has a lot of flavor to it. You get a lot of that Bourbon Barrel. You get a lot of a really solid stout. No one characteristic really kind of steals the show. They all play off each other perfectly. A really, really well-crafted beer. And again, it's 6.9%, widely available, and it's very affordable. You know, it's, it's, it's hard not to give this one an A. Definitely, I recommend checking this one out. A big surprise for me and a very pleasant one at that. I'm going to go enjoy the rest of this. And remember, folks, life's too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers.